Hi folks, I'm George Davis. I'm a candidate for Supervisor District 8, uh, Castro, Upper Market, uh, Noe Valley, uh, Glen Park, DeVos Triangle, uh, Castro. So uh, I'm best known, uh, especially, you know, internationally. Uh, in fact, I've had people say I should probably be running in London or New York and not in San Francisco as an advocate for body freedom and civil liberties. Uh, since the passage of the nudity ban, uh, running for office, I have been, and this is with the full knowledge of the mayor's office and the San Francisco Police Department, I have been arrested twice, cited once, and threatened with arrest two other times while making campaign speeches. Uh, so these are the same speeches on body freedom that I have made for years in the city. August of this year, I went to New York City with the full knowledge of the New York Police Department and the New York Mayor's Office. I made the same type of body freedom speech in the center of Times Square and uh, it was picked up by Associated Press. It went all over the country and it seems to be dropped as an issue in this city, uh, you know, which used to be recognized as a center for progressive, liberal, cutting edge thought. And we have a question of whether it's going away. Uh, I'm here to fight it. Uh, if you want to join in, you fight. Uh, this is not a classical issue uh, for running for supervisor. So I'm going to go back to the classical issues, uh, which are economic security and, uh, uh, and neighborhood control of pro property development in the city. Uh, and we're seeing some trends away from this. Uh, you should know that I have the endorsement of the San Francisco Tenants Union. 62% uh, of the households in this district are renters. And of the homeowners and condo owners, uh, most of them are former renters and are very sensitive to tenants' rights. So I'm for the passage of Proposition G on this ballot, which uh, puts a uh, real estate property tax on people uh, flipping properties within five years to curb Ellis Act evictions. And the Ellis Act evictions do uh, uh, dishouse a lot of the longer term residents of the city, especially seniors. And, uh, and, and also the extension of rent control to properties built after 1979 and to make this uh, a more equitable place for long-term residents and make it secure for them. Also, I'm for the uh, uh, neighborhood control of planning. Uh, for example, uh, we, a couple of years ago, we had the uh, 8 Washington Project, uh, which would have blocked off with a high rise, much of Telegraph Hill. Uh, this is a project that was opposed by the Telegraph Hill dwellers, the supervisor of the neighborhood, and the neighborhood residents. Uh, this, is, uh, uh, this is something we're seeing more and more of. Uh, we're seeing the uh, Wilsh Wilshire Boule Boulevardization of the Upper Market District in our own neighborhood. Uh, and these are, you know, these are issues that are really not being done with neighborhood impact. Uh, there's been some uh, trending away from environmental reviews, uh, which uh, we definitely need to have more input from the neighborhoods on these projects. Uh, I don't really believe in long speeches. So for those that are looking for uh, further details on my campaign, including a uh, uncensored video, uh, not safe for work, how many political candidates can say that, a video on San Francisco before and after the nudity van, and a video on my speech in New York City. Uh, you can go to uh, my campaign site, George Davis. Supervisor George Davis. WordPress. Com. Again, for more details, go to Supervisor George Davis. WordPress. Com. Thank you.